Hello and welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Today we look at a murderer who beat his partner to death in a Derbyshire home has been sentenced to life in prison. Anthony Davis launched a brutal attack on Keely McGarth, 30, at a house in Alfred Street, South Normanton in the early hours. The court heard Mr Davis, fueled by alcohol, attacked Miss McGarth after he discovered she had been having an affair with a neighbour. She was found lying on a settee by paramedics who had been called to the house by a family friend. She was pronounced dead at the scene. Prosecutor barrister Michael Orty QC said the victim's bra had been forcibly pulled apart, her breasts were bruised and there were cuts to her groin and her left buttock. Mr Davis was arrested and later charged with her murder. He denied it but was convicted by a jury at Nottingham Crown Court. Before her death, Miss McGarth rang Mr Davis 60 times and texted him saying, these kids need you and want you. Mr Davis, 39, of Alfred Street, South Normanton, was sentenced to life in prison, he will serve a minimum of 24 years in prison. Detective Inspector Toby Forkett Greaves, who led the investigation, said, Keely McGarth was an excellent mother and she loved her children dearly. She was murdered in her own home by Anthony Davis following a brutal attack. Mr Davis went on to claim Miss Keeley had caused her own injuries. I am extremely relieved that Mr Davis, a dangerous man, has now been convicted and will spend many years in prison as a result of his crime. My thoughts first and foremost are for Keeley's family and friends. Although no sentence will heal such a wound, I hope it goes some way to giving them a sense that justice has been done. Their trust in our detectives and staff, their patience with our investigation and their faith in what we put before the jury have been unfaltered. They have endured terrible accounts and seen shocking images relating to Keeley's ordeal and they have conducted themselves throughout with absolute dignity and I am pleased we have been able to achieve this result for them. I am also relieved for the officers and staff involved in this investigation. No murder investigation is easy or straightforward and this was particularly challenging in the sense that we were dealing with the death of a woman with young children killed at the hands of a man she should have been able to trust. The tenacity and the professionalism of the officers and the staff involved is what has led us where we are and with Anthony Davis being brought to justice and now behind bars. So what are your thoughts about Anthony Davis? Please share your thoughts in the comments below and until next time stay safe.